it, YouTube. My name is Santiago Pacheco, and I do sax tutorials right here on YouTube. And uh, most of my videos are actually in Spanish because I found a, a good market there a few years back when I started doing this. Uh, so, uh, you know, for the exception of one or two and this video, uh, most of them are in Spanish, right? But every once in a while, I find a song that I, I feel like it's either going to hit or, uh, or, you know, it's got a really cool sax lick that I like. Uh, and somebody brings it to my attention uh, on one of the comments I think on the on the problem uh, tutorial or talk dirty tutorial that I did if you haven't checked them out I suggest you go look for those uh, uh, I might leave a link at the end of this video uh, for 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 those videos but anyways somebody left a comment say hey can you make the flow the new flow rider song uh, the, I think it's GDFR you know I just start I just heard it yesterday right so this morning I try to I try to learn the lick, and it's a it's a pretty cool lick, you know. It's kind of hard because it has an E, a high E, and uh, it goes to the B B E combination. There, it's kind of hard because he does it uh, fast. But uh, but it, but it, you know, with a little practice, you know, if you play for uh, depending how good you are, you know, you might play for a couple hours or uh, it took me maybe uh, 20 minutes to get used to it or whatever. But uh, if even if it takes you a week to do it, you know, who cares, right? As long as you get to play it <laughs> anyways I don't want to take too much of your time um, I want to get right into this video uh, I do I, I have a weird way of writing my notes um, and the reason I, I, I don't write them in music I do know how to write music and read music but I I, I designed a certain way of, of doing this you know my own way uh, so that way everybody even the people that read music and and the people that are just starting off uh, everybody can can learn this song right and all I do is I write the write the note right the A B C D E F G note not the do re mi fa sol la si do uh, I write the note right and if it's in black right if it's if the notes uh, in the color black then it's without the register key right because there, there were questions about about that last time uh, on one of the other videos and if it's a red note right a red letter it's with the register key right and if it has a line right under it if it's underlined then it's the 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 keys back here the, the high keys right the palm keys is what they call them uh and it, this song only has one it's which is the e right which is the the middle one here and the button back the button up here right so other than that i mean it should be pretty easy uh he he plays it most of the song he plays it down an octave right and then uh and then uh, on the bridge or whatever, he goes up an octave, and that's when it gets a little hard with with that B and E combination. You'll see, you'll see what I'm talking about when I when I show you right now. But uh, without further ado, uh, if if you like this video, you know, hit like. If you don't, well, you know, I hope you find a better video. <laughs> and uh, don't forget to subscribe. And uh, every once in a while, like I say, when I find a nice, good little lick, or if you guys hear one, uh, just let me know, and uh, I'll, I'll check out the song and. And if it's if it's cool, then you know, if I like it, I'll do it. That's kind of my uh, my way of doing things. <laughs> well, anyways, let's get this going here. All right, we're gonna try to breeze through here now that I change the camera angle here, so you can see my fingers. Uh, like I said before, the black notes are without the octave key, and the red notes are with the octave key. Right? We only have that E. I put that part, the beginning part, in parentheses. You play that beginning three times. And then you go to that bottom, that bottom row, right? So anyways, we're trying to get through here. It sounds kind of like this. We're going to go in normal speed. And I'm going to slow it down, break it down a little bit for you, right? So like I said, this is the first part. Uh, uh, basically, this is a part that plays throughout the song, right? Except for the bridge. And it sounds like this. That's kind of what it sounds like uh, in full speed. Let's go. Uh, let's go half speed here, so you can see uh, the fingers a little better. Right, it's kind of chromatic down from the B. A A sharp A G. Right. Go all the way down to that low D. Right. 
pretty simple when you play it slow motion. And actually, this whole bottom part's pretty simple. Again, uh, in, in slow motion. Again, like I said, you play that three times, and then you do that bottom part. I think in the original, it, it just hits that G four times, but I think it, I, I added that little E. I think it's better, you know, to finish off. Uh, and that's basically it. And then when the bridge starts, uh, when when he, when the bridge comes in, he goes up an octave, right? All right, guys, we're gonna jump straight to the bridge part. This is the part where he raises it an octave, right? Uh, in this part, the red notes. It's all red notes because you use the octave key in the whole the whole time for the for the second part, the second lick here. Uh, like I said, it's the same notes, the same part, just an octave higher. Uh, the E. If you notice the E is underlined, that means you use the palm key, it's this back key, right? The high the high E with this button down here, right? Both and the register key. Right? You hit that, that that gives you that note, which is the high E. And that's what makes this part the hardest, right? If you're not good at playing with your palm keys, you're gonna have a real hard time. Uh it's a jump from B to E, right? And then back to E and then B flat, which is A sharp, you know, whichever way you want to look at it. And those that little jump is going to mess you up if you're not used to it, right? Uh, we're going to play normal speed, then we're going to play it uh, half speed, right? And break it down a little bit for you guys. Again, I just learned this song yesterday, right? So <laughs> I'm going to try to uh, play it as clean as possible here for you guys. Here you go. And that's uh, that's uh, normal speed. Now we're gonna break it down, which is actually the part you really need, right? The I play at normal speed so you can kind of hear how it sounds, you know, at full speed. But uh, the breakdown really is the one that you're gonna learn the most in, right? So like I said, the, it starts on B, then you jump to E, right? That's the first hard jump. And then you gotta come back down. And then hit that A sharp, the B, and then the A sharp. Right? You hit it twice. All the way down to the D. Right? And then you do that three times. A little slower. Then the bottom part. I think it just stays on G, like I said on the first part. But I think it's a, it's a, you know, you could do whatever, you know. Those are ba the basic notes. Uh, you know, he does a lot of mixing. I hear a couple parts that, you know, he messed with there. Uh, he mixed them up a little bit. But basically, that's that's the part he uses throughout the whole song, right? And that's it. Well, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> Hopefully, you like this video. Uh, like I said, I, I don't do too many in English. But uh, if I find a good lick, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep doing this, right? Uh, like I said, the first two videos, the problem and the talk dirty did really good. So I'm thinking this one's going to do really good too because it's a newer song. I haven't seen anybody do the tutorial on this song. So uh, so I'm, I'm hoping, you know, you know I'm, I, I draw first blood here. <laughs> so uh, like I said, if you like it, hit like. Look for me on Facebook. I'm already packed on Facebook. I think I got two Facebooks. Uh, one has 5,000 friends and the other one has 4,000 friends. And we just all speak Spanish in there. But uh, but you can uh, you can chat with me right here on, on YouTube also, right? So uh, like I said, hit like, hit subscribe if you like it. I'll see you next time, guys. Bye.